This is Scott the Fix-It Guy. Today we're working on the LG Trom. It has the um, LE error and that is a problem with the motor and a lot of times it comes from this part. Here's our part number. This is called the rotor and when the machine gets overloaded these plastic splines right here get kind of stripped and then this thing doesn't spin as it should so we're just going to be replacing this one to cure the LE error. There's other things that can cause the LE error for example <clears throat> this thing which is the stator has a sensor on it and this sensor sometimes can have problems so could be that you may just need to change this sensor which is pretty cheap um, it's unlikely that you would have to change the whole thing. Sometimes that's the case, but probably it's either the sensor or these splines have worn out because the machine got overloaded. There were th maybe blankets or something that was so heavy that when the motor <coughs> was trying to turn, the spin basket just wouldn't turn with it and it would strip out this plastic. So when that happens, something has to give. And this plastic is what they've designed to, to fail. So we're going to be replacing this today. So to do the repair, we've removed the back cover here. It just has some screws you got to pop out. We have a 17 millimeter socket. We have to remove this bolt to get the rotor off. Also, when you are looking for the LE air, just make sure that these wires are okay. I'm going to make sure you don't see any tears or cuts. So if this wire harness is, is damaged, it will also cause that LE error. It's usually just this plastic spline, though. We're going to put on the ratchet. So one thing you can do is put in a standard head screwdriver inside these veins. And then some about maybe a quarter inch in. And then you can see that it's going to get caught right there. And that keeps the rotor from turning. And then it's easier to get this, this bolt to come off. It kind of holds it while you're spinning that bolt off. Usually at the factory they put Loctite on... So the bolt doesn't want to come off, which is which is good. You don't want that thing loosening, but <clears throat> it's a little bit harder to get off. There we go. Okay, and now grab the rotor, pull it toward us. It should kind of wiggle off the splines. go. There's the old one. So these are the metal splines and they won't fail but the plastic might. And then <coughs> this is stator and then there's the um, sensor put in, into position. Looks good. Also, if these magnets were to break loose and be out of position, it'll cause the LE error. But that's pretty, pretty rare. It looks like these things are probably just wiped out. <clears throat> <clears throat> so we can com compare and contrast here. The old and the new. Here's the old ones. And if you look carefully, you can see that these should be triangles, but they're they're rounded. So that's that's it being stripped. I look at the new ones, and we can see very clearly a lot more material and more like triangles. This one rounded. This one nice triangles. So now to put on the new one, <clears throat> pretty easy. 
just going to put it onto the, onto the spline and be aware there's pretty powerful magnetic force that's going to pull that on right so just take your time and wiggle that in <clears throat> and then as you put on the bolt as it tightens it'll pull the um <coughs> It'll pull the metal shaft towards you. Put that on, and then we'll tighten this up. Same thing <clears throat> to lock the rotor. Just get something put in the vein, and then <clears throat> that'll allow you to get it tighter. You get it pretty tight because you don't want this thing to slip and then cause another LE error. But usually, what's going to cause that is just washing things over. That are too heavy, like bathroom mats, blankets, comforters, sleeping bags, wipe out most machines. <clears throat> These are really designed well for clothing and sheets, towels, but anything bigger can be trouble. Pretty tight. Okay, and that's it. We're just gonna put the cover back on, and that repair is done. There we go. screws. Okay, we're going to load it back up. So, clothing, <clears throat> sheets is okay, towels are okay. There's about as much as you want to load. <clears throat> So, you're not cramming stuff in. Should be a good test. Here are some close-up pictures of the splines on the rotor that were worn out. And they're just a little bit rounded. That's because the uh, metal abrades on them. And that's why you got the LE error. So thanks so much for watching and please subscribe when you get a chance.